Today we're going to do a side-by-side -side comparison of the Nufi Air 75 and the Keytron V1 mechanical keyboard. We're going to take a look at the hardware, specs, and overall feel of these two keyboards. Now I'm not sponsored by Nufi or Keytron, but I love their products and simply wanted to share my experience with them. My name is Shai, welcome back to the channel, let's jump right in. So let's talk about the build first. The Nufi is made of aluminum and the Keytron is made of ABS plastic. The Nufi feels slightly sturdier here for me, which I do like. The Nufi is one pound lighter, which I also like because it's super portable. However, if this is going to stay on your desk, you may like the extra weight and stability of the Keytron. Let's look at the full dimensions of these keyboards. The Nufi is just slightly smaller in length and width, which is a little better for carrying around. Now out of the box, the Nufi comes with the USB-C cable, switch puller, and additional keys. The Keytron comes with a USB-C cable, switch puller, keycap puller, screwdriver, and hex key. Both have hot swappable keys and both have RGB backlit lights, though the Nufi has sideline RGB lights as well. All boils down to preference. I went with the blue switch for the Nufi and red switch for the Keytron. If you're new to mechanical keyboards, the color of the switch determines whether the feel of the keyboard will be soft, clicky, or gentle. The Nufi is nice and clicky, and the Keytron is nice and soft. Again, boils down to your personal preference. So let's hear how they both sound. The Nufi has large letters and keys. The Keytron has smaller letters and keys. I like the large letters for obvious reasons. However, I could go either way with more space between the keys on the Keytron versus the tighter space on the Nufi. However, I do find that I am a little more accurate typing on the Keytron because perhaps there is more space between the keys. The Nufi has removable feet and the Keytron has two adjustable feet. The feet don't matter to me as I like my keyboards flat. However, I know some people prefer options in the height for their keyboard, so the Keytron wins here. Both are compatible with Mac and Windows. There's a toggle switch for that on both of these keyboards. The Nufi can connect through Bluetooth and both can connect through USB-C wire. Overall, it boils down to personal preference. And after trying these two keyboards out, I chose to keep the Nufi Air 75. I love the lighter weight and smaller compact form factor. It makes more sense for me portable wise and the large keys and clickiness feels really good to me. It also lays lower and flatter which is comfortable for my preferred ergonomics. Thanks for stopping by today. I hope this video helped give you a good look at these two mechanical keyboards. Stick around and check out my product reviews and some of my tutorials for creators. I really would appreciate the like and subscribe. And as always, I'll see you on the next video.